This is Gojira Kaiju Dai Kesen. It is technically a fighting game. That's what I think. Yeah, it's a fighting game. And pretty much, I don't see why there's more Godzilla fighting games. So let's get started, shall we? So you have a choice of Gojira, and those are special modes, Angiras, or Angiras, King Ghidorah. Gigan Megalon Mecha Gojira Violante. Oh, and he's an ugly little fucker. And of course, Mothra. Or Masuda. So, since we got all our characters, we have eight in all. So, we're going to go with the big G. Because why not? Of course, you can pick any of any of the um, other monsters, except your own. So basically, let's go with Mosada. So we are here in the Mode 7 battlefield. Gojira! Tai! Mosura! So of course this is versus Mothra. And As a game of this caliber, I have to say, yeah. Just, just saying that they remember the theme songs. Wow. They get in, they get instant win for that. Like I said, it's, it's kind of a quickie game, but since I did promise a Godzilla game, well, why not use, why not get probably the best, um, okay, well, if it's not the best, it is probably the best selection I could come up with. Now, the question is, how come... A game of this caliber could not get this kind of attention here in the States. What did we get? A dumbass fighting game. That's all we got. We got ourselves a dumbass strategy game.
And sadly, it wasn't even a decent one. But you know what? I digress. But at least here, at least here, you can honestly say that it is a decent Godzilla game. And this is the game that was basically, we can pretty much say was destroy all monsters. Or, since this is Super Famicom, Godzilla Super Destroy All Monsters. Because as you know, nobody can destroy Godzilla. Oh, I'm sorry, Gojira. I'm so used to saying Godzilla, but anyway. So next on our shit list Why don't we go after Mecha Kojira? All those years of payback Because really this is his town. Because really, there can be only one Godzilla. And that Godzilla is the real thing. So for all you Godzilla aficionados, this is for you. If there is one thing One thing that I do know There is a mode that I would like to do As a special feature Just because Just because it's Godzilla. Oh! <laughs> Just because I'm a bitch. <laughs> Just because you just don't mess with the big G. You just don't. You just don't mess with the big G. Let's see, we take on Megaron. Megaron. The aftermath of Tokyo Tower. Damn, really? Really? Damn, really? So that's how it's going to be, huh?
Yeah, folks, this is how a Godzilla game really should be. It shouldn't be about strategy. You know why? Because monsters don't have strategy. They just tear shit up. Because really, monsters don't need strategy. Really, monsters don't need strategy. Monsters don't need maps. They only need to tear up everything in their wake. You know, like Rampage. I mean, if, I mean, I swear, if the Nintendo version of Godzilla was more attuned to, like, to, like, say this. Then it would be very likable indeed. That really would have been cold-blooded right there. Anyway, I digress. Of course I'm going to continue. Because nobody puts Godzilla in the corner. Nobody puts the baby in the corner! So let's go with Angiras. Because I am totally asking for it. <laughs> But, I mean, it's a standard fighting game. And for the Super Famicom... All I have to say is... Hey, it works for me. Because strategy only works for Super Robots. I'm getting my tail smacked around. Well, like I said, this is this is probably going to be a quickie, just to show you that you know there is a Godzilla game around. So with that, if I don't beat this game, well then or actually beat this round, well then... It's just gonna suck, isn't it? But at least... But at the very least, I have to say... This is at least a little better than what we got in the States. So therefore, Godzilla has fallen. I don't think I'm going to continue. So therefore, that was Gojira Kaiju Daikesen. For the Super Famicom, I've been Pookie Ezzy Seven, and I hope you enjoyed. Stay tuned for a little extra something in your goodie bag tonight.